Why pay the insurance company interest? My name is Darius. And I'm Carmen. And we're the founders of Wealth Nation. We teach entrepreneurs and go-getters how to own their own lifestyle through the concept of infinite banking. So make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell so that you can be notified every time we come out with brand new videos. And also, are you ready to level up your infinite banking game? If so, check us out on Patreon where we teach you how to incorporate infinite banking into your lifestyle. And this is information that we don't teach anywhere else, so check us out. Yes, so let's get right into the video. Why should we pay interest to the insurance company? Well, we pay interest to the bank when we get a loan from them. Why not pay interest to the insurance company when we get a loan, when we collateralize our policy and get a loan from the insurance company? Mm -hmm. There's no different. No. Right? Because when we get a loan for our cars, when we get a loan for our mortgages, uh, credit cards, personal loans, student loans, all these loans are require us to pay interest. Yeah. The only difference is we don't, we aren't able to share in the return <laughs> for any of these uh, interest rates that we pay to the bank. Nope, we don't see any of that. It doesn't come back to us at all. So the reason why we talk about why should you pay interest to the insurance company is mm -hmm. because subconsciously we are probably paying interest right now as we speak. Right. <laughs> and you don't even realize it. Like you, you under you know that you're paying interest, but you don't know how much interest you're actually paying. Right. And so for us, when we talk about pay interest to the insurance company, because the the sign on the door is the only difference between insurance companies and banks. Mm -hmm. And I really want to make sure that you guys understand that. So the whole point of paying interest to the insurance company is because the insurance company is going to charge you 5%. Now, when it comes to any other loan that you may get from the bank, I'm sure market rate is a little bit higher than 5% in some instances, mm -hmm. especially when we're talking about credit cards and personal loans. And when we talk about auto loans, we're talking more so uh, pre-owned auto loans, not necessarily the ones that come right off the, the shelf. Right. But think about it, when you pay them interest, you may be paying five, six, seven, 10, 12%. So in, in essence, all you do is pay the 5% to the insurance company and the difference, which is the market rate, is what goes back to you. You mm -hmm. pay that full amount, but you pay the 10%, but you're gonna split it five and five. Five goes to the insurance company and five goes to you. And that 5% interest, what does that do for you? It grows your cash value, it increases your dividend, and it increases the death benefit. So it's a win-win situation. All we're doing is just pivoting and working with a company that will allow us to have a little bit more flexibility in our financial goals so that that interest can come back to us. And that interest we're putting right back into the cash value into your policy so that it can grow it exponentially. Right. Well, no, 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 I still want to pay interest to the bank. I'd rather give them my hard-earned money than finance things myself so that I can keep those additional profits. Mm -hmm. what, do you, what do you say to that? Very good question. <laughs> <laughs> Since we're on YouTube, I'm going to give you my PC <laughs> version of that. No, um, I, I would just say that's fine. At the end of the day, everyone is going to have their own opinion of how they should work their finances. Yeah. So if you prefer to pay the bank, that's totally fine. But you know what? We may have a deal for you. Let us know. <laughs> we'll give you the loan. You can pay us the interest. How about that? Right. <laughs> so there, I recently had a situation where a family member asked to borrow money. Mm -hmm. Now, when family member borrows money, mm -hmm. do you charge them interest? Before infinite banking, no. Now, yes. Now, yes. Because that... The Ooh, point. Before infinite banking, when family would ask for money, it'd be like, oh, no. You know? <laughs> now it's like, we can, do it. we can do that deal. We can make it happen. <laughs> <laughs> and I can give you a really good rate. Because when it comes to money, we finance every single thing that we do. Yes. Be it through the bank or through our whole life insurance policy, you're still financing things in life. Mm -hmm. Even when you save up money to pay cash for it, you're still financing it because you are saving on a consistent basis to get this thing that you're that that you're working towards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So in any case, we're fine. We finance every single thing that we do. So why not do it through a mutual insurance company where you're able to pay a low interest rate mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and keep the difference when you compare it to market rate. Mm -hmm. And the other piece of it too, when we're talking about obtaining loans and third party, third party financing, we always have to come up with collateral. 
Yes. So if you are uh, getting a car loan, a, home, a mortgage, whatever the case may be, you're always putting an asset up for collateral. Mm -hmm. So this action is not any different. You know, just because we're using an insurance policy and putting that, that up as collateral, it, it's the same concept. Don't mm -hmm. let the fact that we're talking about insurance now um, mess you up as far as the conceptual piece of collateral. Mm -hmm. Whenever you're getting money from anybody, you have to come with something. You have to put your skin in the game to make sure that that other person is going to get their funds. And when we're talking about insurance policies, we're just putting our policy up as collateral. Right. So I hope this video really cleared up some things for you as far as okay why in the world would i want to pay interest to the insurance company when i can just pay interest to the bank yeah. so subscribe to our youtube channel and hit the notification bell and check out our patreon page yes and always remember own your own lifestyle or someone else will <laughs>